Hello guys, welcome back. In this video, we will explore the typography component from Mind Design. We will explore its different components. So we will see uh, how to use the title component from Mind Design, the different levels of the uh, title like H1, H2, H3, and we will then explore the text component and how uh, we can use different variations of text like uh, strong, underlined, uh, mark disabled and then uh, different variations like whether it's a success message warning etc and then we will learn how to use the link component so we can add a link and it uh, we can navigate to different pages and then we will see how we can use the paragraph component and then it's uh, different variations of the paragraph how we can make uh, the text or the paragraph editable so we can uh, edit it and how we can customize the editable icons and also how we can customize these tooltips uh, while editing and how we can make the paragraph or the text copyable so once it's copied we can paste it anywhere and we can uh, make the copy the text the same text copied or we can ma even make the different text copied so we can customize that as well then we will see how we can uh, use the ellipses and uh, how we can customize the, the expand or the show more buttons and next uh, in the last we will see how we can add the ellipses in the middle of the text so let's get started i have an empty react.js project that is using end design and right now it's showing nothing so let's go ahead and import typography and uh, from typography uh, we will be importing through few components like title text paragraph and link so let's use them one by one so starting from the title uh, for the title you can consider that uh, like it is the h1 or h2 h3 tags so let's write the uh, title code with Amir as you go you can see uh, by default it will be the h1 and uh, if you want to change its level to h2 or h3 you can uh, use the prop level and it will be you no know, h2 h3 and h5 right let's change its level to maybe level 3 right so this is how the title works so next let's use the text again code with Amir and here you go by default and we can change uh, the text styles like we can make it strong here you go let's copy and try different variations so we can make it underline and we can make that as mark and then we can make it maybe disabled so this is this will be disabled right and then we can make it uh, there is another type uh, type we can make it uh, looks like a success message or the the danger message or the warning message so things, things like that so it will be danger secondary secondary is similar to the text, this text uh, success and warning let's use the success as you go uh, so this is how the text looks like uh, now let's add uh, one for the link so for the link you can consider uh, this as a a tag yep so code with Amir and let's underline this as well here you go and for the link we can provide the href uh, maybe we can say https www.google.com right 
and now if, if I hover on it you see uh, here www.google.com right so this is how the link works so next let's go ahead and use the paragraph uh, again code with Amir so this is paragraph and we can use uh, almost all of these uh, types in the paragraph as well so if, if it is strong this is how it looks like right and next go ahead and use uh, some other props like uh, we can make the, these text at editable so if I use editable so it will show a little icon for the edit and now I can change it to anything but right now it's not saving because uh, we always say that uh, uh, the text is this one so to change it uh, let's use the state so const uh, we can say text set text is equal to use state and by default we can say code with Amir and here uh, the text we can say whatever is in our state right and for the editable uh, uh, we can say on change whenever there is any change we get the value the change value and we set uh, we, we change our state to the updated value right so now if I change it to So it will be showing the change value, right? And we can also uh, right now if, uh, when I click on this one, it makes it, it is as editable. Uh, we can change this to both. If we click here or here, it, it can be made editable. So so that will be trigger type, and uh, if we can uh, set that icon. Uh, text so so wherever I, if if I click here it will make it editable or click here it will make editable also there is showing a tooltip edit we can change that as well so tooltip click to edit maybe so if I click here click to edit right and we can also change this icon as well if needed so let's copy this one and change the icon as well so let's set a smile uh, maybe field right let's refresh here you go let's click on it let's make edit table this is change text here you go we can also uh, change this uh, icon as well so the enter icon uh, maybe you can say check check outlined save it here you go the check outlined right So we have uh, almost uh, customized each and everything here for the edit table. And next, let's do something for the uh, copy. So we can show a copy text uh, icon here, and once you click on it, so the text got copied. So it is code with Amir and we can say copyable right here you go so when i click on it it's saying copy click copied so now that this text should be copied if i paste it here here you go code with amir right so we can also customize this icon this tool tip as well so let's try that so it will be tool tips 
So, here we will be uh, providing two tip two tool tips once uh, it is in this state before copy and one after copied. So, we can say click to copy and we can say maybe done. So, whatever you want to write here you can click to copy done right and also if needed we can uh, instead of copying this text we can uh, set the, the copy text is some different one. So, maybe we can say the text which will be copied uh, will be different text copied. So, copy and now if I paste it here, so different text copied right. and we can change uh, these icons as well. So, that will be using this icon. Let us keep this as it is. Okay, so, next uh, let us uh, try a different prop that is uh, sometimes you need uh, to show uh, the ellipses in the text. So, that will be like this one ellipses. So, uh, in the ellipses uh, we can provide when to show the ellipses. So, when we can say based on the number of rows or based on the width right. So, if if I say the rows if if the number of rows are 2 show the ellipses right. So, right now if the number of line is only 1. So, let us make it let us copy this text multiple times and make uh, number of rows greater than 1 and let us uh, fix this style uh, to a width of maybe we can say 100 pixel. There you go. So, when the number number of lines are more than 2 it shows uh, the ellipses right and when you want to when you if you want to show something uh, show more or uh, expand text here so that it can be expanded so that will be expandable true here you go let's increase the width to 200 pixels yep code with amir and if you expand it it's expanded right and we can change uh, this this text as well. So, that is symbol and we can say show more here you go. So, it will be showing show more text yep and also if needed we can uh, instead of ellipsing at the end we can ellipse in the middle and we, we need to provide a suffix at the end. So, let us try one example example of that as well. So, in that case if want to say that uh, always show the uh, code with Amir at the end or whatever you want to say uh, that should be always be sh shown we can uh, show that ok here you go. So, it with, with lips is at uh, in the mid in the middle so code with amir will always be shown at the end and then show more so all text is shown right so that's it on exploring the typography from the end design so we have explored different components like title text paragraph link and diff different variations of title different variation of the text uh, how to make the paragraph strong edit table uh, so, uh, we can make uh, the paragraph editable also we can make the text editable as well. So, it, it, it will be similar here you go. So, click to edit yeah this one now it is a text instead of uh, the paragraph. So, it works the, the same way right and next we will learn how to make the text ellipses and then ellipses in, in the middle and uh, how to make uh, the text copyable and uh, copy the text right. 
so that's it on exploring the typography component from and design and if you have any questions please let me know in the comments below and if you have learned something please hit like subscribe to my channel see you in the next video thank you